the act to learning is and i'll use a practical tool is you just have to spend time learning about that thing the more you spend learning about it, that thing the more you know and it's like i'm sure there's a rule or theory to it i know it at the basic level the more time i spend with you as a friend <coughs> the more of friends we are and the issue we have same thing with marry same thing with life like same with age the more we spend on it the more experienced we are i just got a second day more more experience man another second more another second more experience this is not finishing and i need to get back to work mm. so back to the number you have this number it could be in your savings account so that's why i'm not putting a particular pin to it it could be your knowledge because i was saying it's not just limited to financial and bank stuff it's just life is supply and demand buying and selling it could be knowledge but you need one that you have lots of so if it's knowledge it could be like a financial person and they have a lot of the knowledge right now i'm acquiring the skill of like multifaceted skills so as to be able to run a business and that's like a business knowledge skill that could be demanded for and can be monetized because then demand if this person's got 50 billion and i demand i mean i'm, I'm going extreme now so is easy on the body but for emphasis sake if this person's got 50 billion and i've acquired the skill of business running skill um strong mo80 or so to say goodwill competitive ad advantage for a company i have acquired that skill where i've been able to like drive operational costs low i've acquired all this skill and this person does not want to go through the stress because he has like he's leveraged up and in some other areas that is once again one vehicle his own vehicle now if he comes to me demand and supply oh i need this knowledge how do i do this how do i do this how do i do this and i say to him yeah i've got the knowledge you've got this 50 billion i need 250 thousand oh let's go low i need 2500 actually let's go lower i need 250 thousand pounds for it and i give you all the business knowledge so i could price at whatever and as i'm talking about knowledge now it could be anything it could be literally anything it could be this spoon it could be this play it could be but you need that one thing i'm down i'm talking in terms of plate and spa i'm talking about goods and services uh, goods in terms of the one i just talked previously on that's knowledge now that, that could be offered as a service this is goods they are both vehicles a business in itself a vehicle a job a vehicle a drunkard <laughs> If that number is increasing, like this, what this means is oblivious to whatever situation you've got. If you can grow this number and you just keep growing it and growing it, and remember, whatever goes into that number does not come back out. So, if it's knowledge now, whatever you know, you know. I use this practical example. If you know how to change a tire, come rain, sunshine, come torture, come anything, come, come blindness, come seeing, come. <laughs> Come uh, divorce, come hatred, come war. You will still not change your fucking tire. So that's once goes in doesn't come out. If that's your vehicle, knowledge. If knowledge is your vehicle, so you have to just keep learning. I'm like for myself now. Knowledge is one of my vehicles that I don't even know what to use now. I'm saying I want to use like in ten years, fifteen years from now because it's going to be insane what a vehicle is going to be at that point in time, right? And I will still keep on just leveling it up because now it's going to be a vehicle of mine. And when I'm saying very good, that's that one thing. The number. Whether it's knowledge, whether it's uh like if if you don't want to stress, like this is this is choice now. Like I chose to do this. If I don't want to stress and I don't want to do anything, I just invest in like stocks and shares I saw. Keep on increasing the number and that's it. Actually, there's things you could invest in because you could say, Oh, why stocks and shares I saw? Stocks and shares are tax free. You could invest in that. You could invest in general investment accounts if you understand how mutual funds work and um, 
if you understand dividends, this thing, dividend, um, dividends return, that's going for lower dividends because it's in the general investment account, they will tax it. So you want something that will come out that will produce small, 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 small percentage of dividends. That's if you want to go the dividends rate, cash flow. And if you want to go growth, the growth, you understand, once you understand it, because now that is going to be your vehicle. So you just keep leveraging and learning on learning on that vehicle and keep increasing on it. Just that one vehicle. That's if you don't want to stress because that is like low barrier of entry. Like you do what, 10 minutes of study a day and you are good for life. <laughs> Actually, you are, if you do that, just let